So my best friend that I grew up with overdosed and he passed away and he left a newborn here and his mother, Linda, she's been really having a hard time, she's having some financial hardships. So we just bought her a vehicle and we're getting ready to go introduce her to this vehicle. So I'm super excited. It's Thanksgiving, time for thanks, time for giving. And this is what we're doing. So <laughs> here we go. This is a whole surprise for her. Whole surprise. <laughs> I'm excited for her, buddy. You ready? Yes. Linda, how are you? How are you? I want to show you something. Come right here. So I know you mentioned that you've been having some car problems. Yeah. We took it upon ourselves to buy you a new car. What? <laughs> no. No. Don't it's even. Yours. No way. It's yours. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, this welcome. is this is unbelievable. <laughs> I can't believe he did that. God has been a blessing to me, and it's grateful I get to be a blessing to you. <laughs> you deserve it. No, 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 no. You have such a beautiful heart. You're so amazing. You're like a mother to all of us. Clint would be so proud. Yeah, he sure would be. He was one of my best friends. You know, like I've never experienced someone as loyal as Clint. He loved all his friends so much. He had the biggest heart. And that's the sad thing because he had such a big heart. And, and not to see his baby and everything. He wanted kids so bad. He was so excited when Cassandra got pregnant. And he told me, you know. I miss him too. No, I miss him every day. I can't even. Yeah, every day I think about him, you know. This is him right here. I know. I keep I him right next to me all the time. Nobody knows because it's shit. It's cold.